Australia was the only other country in the world to build them apart from the USA and we designated them the CA-17 and the CA-18, different models of Commonwealth aircraft. Flown today by Paul Bennett, the lead aircraft. Second aircraft by Matt Hall. Give him a wave, ladies and gentlemen. Matt uh, in that second machine. That's part of the syndicate that operates out of Caboolture. First aircraft uh, is owned and part of the collection by uh, Ross Pay. Collection put together by he and his late father up at Scone. just sound different in a Mustang. Yeah, you can hear them in a Spitfire, you can even hear them in the P40F Kitty Hall. They come diving in from high right. Over 17, uh, 16,700 of these eventually produced. tactics once the Luftwaffe realized what the uh, aircraft could do is they tried to bounce them as they'd come over the, the coast to get them to drop their uh, uh, underwing fuel tanks and uh, so they could engage in combat because they couldn't dogfight very well with those tanks on and of course once they dropped them they couldn't get to Berlin. Coming in from the right again now. Listen to that sound. Now this time, that Mustang is the uh, is the Pay Mustang, as you were just talking about, yep. um, being flown by uh, Paul Bennett. By Paul Bennett, yes. Now this is uh, one of Australia's oldest and uh, most well-known warbirds, you might say. Zero five is uh, Bob Eastgate's aircraft. displays today of both aircraft by first Matt Hall and the Caboolture Mustang. Those Wiraways will be performing very soon. The Blue Spinner was uh, the marking applied to number 82 squadron. Highly recommended. That's the, uh, the beauty of a lot of these warbirds that have now been converted over to two-seat configuration. Very soon we should have a uh, two-seat Spitfire here in Australia. Ooh. Cross replica. So head in there and support them. There's plenty of food, uh, lots of other merchandising around the place, but we're going to have a weather hold for about 15 to 20 minutes, give you plenty of warning uh, so that you all don't get soaked like this morning. There is, as, as we said, yeah, weather hold because there, if you have a look on your weather radar, you'll see that there is another cell of rain coming through. So uh, if you want to get under a bit more cover, feel free to seek that out. Lots of uh, hangar space there with ours that you can get into and uh, go through the Connie, go through some of the other aircraft as well. You can, uh, you can weather, weather the weather down there under the Catalina wing. It's a huge <laughs> wing that you can hide under. Now look at those two magnificent Mustangs out there taxiing in together and they've specially set that up so that if you want to get a shot with the two of them together 